I do see it. Right here we got Rab for another edition of the Grill Pimp. Rab's going to be making uh, Philly cheesesteaks and French dips tonight. We just finished doing uh, another breeding with a couple of our bulldogs and uh, now he's cooking. People seem to enjoy these videos so let me film a few more. Rab likes doing them. Over here we got Colton. And of course, Rob's beautiful wife, Steph. Inside we get uh, Tammy, Sarah, and uh, my boy Max. stuff to make the French dip and the, the filling. I usually get the medium rare roast beef. And this is something I make a lot at home too. Uh, I like to fry the uh, roast beef up and uh, put it on some toast and buns. It comes out pretty good. I typically make my French au jus sauce from uh, French onion soup with a uh, little Worcestershire and then I like to put some uh, cayenne pepper in for a little kick. I made my own hammer. You were in the with what? That all came from that. Yeah, yeah. Yep. That, that all came from that. Looks good. I know some people had asked before about the intermittent fasting I had mentioned before uh, I can provide a link down below typically uh, I don't eat uh, between uh, 16 and 18 hours a day and then uh, I eat a big meal and uh, do a little snacking that meaning, uh, six hours or so out of the day there's a lot of health benefits uh, raises your natural uh, testosterone and human growth hormone levels and uh, a lot of other health benefits you know uh, Put a couple of links in the description. I'll never go back to eating uh, another way again. Uh, again, three meals a day is uh, typically uh, not what our ancestors ate. It's a modern thing, and it's not healthy to always have food in your digestive system. 
really uh, devote the resources to uh, recovery. Don't take my word for it, I'm just some guy on YouTube. <laughs> It does smell good. Peppers, peppers always smell good. Yeah. I haven't had anything that smells bad. Not really. Anything that you missed out on the ribs though. Oh, the ribs, the ribs the other day. They were so good. We can't make them, but we made it. I made like a. That's how I do them at home, they come up yep. pretty good. Yeah, and then finish them on the grill though with the cover. Which has like probably the best ones you've ever made. Yeah, he they puts were... he puts uh, cinnamon on them when he does that. They really it gives them just a little different taste, it really enhances them. I didn't do apple, I didn't brine them. Yeah. That's what my dad always does. I didn't brine them, I did everything but I I did uh come out super soft. Oh, I, lo I love the cinnamon on them though. That just that, that's really what what makes them. I think the cinnamon. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> makes them taste different than any other original bed. Did you just put a dusting on it before you uh, put them in the tempo yep. all over them, top and yep. bottom. Or? In this one, I didn't do. Um, I used to do cumin. Those are cumin. Some western ribs, but I didn't do that this time. They were. You can ask Sarah how to pronounce it. But there's three ways. We googled it. She makes a choice. <laughs> Sarah, what? how do you say cumin? Coming. <laughs> it's coming. It's actually Google says you can pronounce it three ways. That's the American way. That, that's the American way. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. True. That's all we care about. What? Cumin, cumin, or common. Those are the three different pronounce or pronunciations I got out of Google yesterday. The American way something new every day. I always say cumin. I always say cumin too. Mom said I had to take a pepper, they're good. Yeah, they're good? Mm-hmm. <coughs> my dad made the ribs last time. He grabbed them. Hi, mommy. Just came out. I am a pepper. They were really good. How do you turn out? They don't turn out like that. Come in. There's a trick, so when you take a rack of ribs. Take a break here and uh, come back once he throws the uh, meat on the grill. Well, peppers are done. And uh, Rob's getting ready with the meat. Had to take a piece. Then we're making uh, Philly cheesesteaks and French dip.
Yeah. Mm -hmm. Again, another edition of the Grill Pimp. <laughs> People seem to enjoy these and said they wanted to see more, so we'll be filming these from time to time. Maybe we'll get Rob to start his own channel in the future. We might. I'll help you out how to get things going, and uh, we'll give you numerous shout outs to uh, get some subscribers over there for you. But that's got to stick together. <laughs> but it's also fun to cook with you here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's good. How you doing? You're doing great. Oh, hey, come here, Tim. Put that thing in. Zip that up for a second. They're so good. <laughs> oh, I know. So good. Oh, that's fabulous. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like I said, uh, I must love you if I called you over for that, huh? Right? <laughs> exactly. Thank you. It was funny. Rob, you never cease to amaze me. Buy the shirt and then you can say that. <laughs> well, yeah, you get a shirt made. Chad's working on it. Yeah, I gotta work at it. I'll uh, maybe do that this week. I'll design a grill pimp shirt in my Teespring store. Oh, there you go. I'll have to find a, uh, come up with a good logo for it to download. There's anybody out there who's artistic and you want to design a cool grill pimp logo for a t-shirt for Rob. Uh, I'll buy one, I'll buy your first one. <laughs> Hey Maddie, how you doing? Hi. Uh, Rob's daughter, Maddie. <laughs> That's Sarah's son over there at the basketball. Keegan. Keegan. He was in the last cooking video, I think. Yes. Yep. Good. Surprised he's not asking right now. Actually. Yeah. <laughs> Is your brother not here today or is he in the house? No, he's in the house. They're probably playing Fortnite or something. Yeah. Call of Duty. <laughs> Kid stuff. Kid stuff. Oh, no, I That's my boy, he's pretty strong, huh? <laughs> 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 
When you start, I, uh, you gotta come in like, you know. I had, I had him every day from uh, the time he was 10 years old. Get him up at five every morning and uh, have him working out with me. Uh, well, he's been working out for nine years. Yeah. We got stuff. Woo! Oh, wow. I am so busy for that. <laughs> I didn't realize it could Steph that uses the pole to work out. That's uh, for working out. You are the pole of Steph, teach him the carousel. You want to do a carousel? You do the carousel. Alright, I'm like, 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 I'm I'll finish my story when you get back. Notorious walking out of my stuff. Remember? Scare himself a little bit? No, no. He had to go first, and then we told him to fall through. Hey, you can just put that, like, take a little piece. Wait, 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 Really good. Now you can tell your flat top. Yes. Exactly. I'm already thinking about that. Get out of my head. <laughs> now you have to do a, a video of you seasoning it. Yes. You know. I think I'm going to use your idea and season it with bacon. I, uh, I hadn't heard of that before. Pound of bacon. Does it every time. Kill two birds with one that's, stone. That's, that's what did this was a yeah. pound of bacon. Nice. Oh, you know what they sell now? Uh, I bought them uh, a couple times the other day. They sell these Johnsonville uh, sausage strips. They're like bacon, the spicy ones. Those are tasty on sandwiches. They also sell them in a burger. Yeah, I've had those too. But those bacon strips, man, you fry those up crispy and the spicy sausage bacon strips and you put them on like a turkey club sandwich. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and from there, you can still climb. But this keeps your body away. Complete shoulder Yeah. Yeah, I bet. Complete shoulder There it is. Is that how Tori is that how uh, Tori hurt his tailbone? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it as soon as I saw it. As he slammed himself to the ground. <laughs> Smells so good. Nobody's looking, I'm gonna steal another piece. I have uh, admittedly mixed feelings about my boy uh, being good on the stripper pole there. <laughs> Well, that's a good grip exercise too, I thought, beside your shoulders. Yeah, especially because his hands want to just slide down. Are, so. I've had Max working out since he was about uh, 10 years old again every morning before school. Uh, mostly the uh, type of training we used to do in the military, uh, a lot of calisthenics and gymnastic type moves. Lots of different push ups, dips, muscle ups, pistol squats. Basically all the stuff I do now because uh, I had a pretty serious back injury on the job uh, several years ago. I got hit by a truck and uh, my days of lifting heavy weights are behind me. Kind of how this channel started out. It started out as a vlog of my recovery from a pretty serious work injury. Uh, it started out with my hikes with uh, Lobo and just kind of progressed to what the channel is now. I'm gonna hit uh, pause here until Rob comes back up. Oh, one other sec. 
I'd like to welcome all the new subscribers to the channel. Welcome aboard. Like, subscribe, share, hit the notification bell, and uh, help me grow. I appreciate all the uh, people here, past, present, and uh, future, watching this video. <laughs> but it helps with the eye. Oh, yeah, it definitely really helps to have your elbow in like that. It helps I need you to bunch. see you try yes. something. Give me a little. I'll try last time. Oh, those look good. There you go. And you see how it's nice. Good stuff. Oh, my God. Good stuff. Here we go. There's a salad inside the house you be made. People who ask, why don't I take all my dogs on hikes down at the river? Well, the white Jeep there is my dog truck, so it's not big enough to haul more than two to three large dogs at a time. The yellow Hummer is Rob's. It is not, it's not easy. It is not. I thought it would be easier, but it is very hard to hang on. Yes, it very is. Did you put anything on your hands? Yeah, I put some of the liquid sauce on my hands. Yeah, I I like seeing the butter on the grill. I know it's almost time to eat. Okay. Are you coming over? Is that Tori or Taylor? Taylor. I love the smell of butter on the grill. I know. I love to cook a pan fried uh, steak and then uh, after I flip it over, I like to baste it in butter and rosemary. Oh, and it's so good, dude. I apply some of that uh, Adolf's uh, Greek seasoning to it along with it. Oh. To die for. I'm gonna have to start doing some cooking videos myself yes. now that I got that laptop. Yes. People keep asking me for the uh, recipe to my ugly soup. Uh, your, your ugly soup or your beans? Both. Can't give that away. <laughs> Can't give that away. <clears throat> or you can give part of it away. Yes. And then skip the good parts. Yeah, my son for some reason wants to come over here all the time now when we come over. <laughs> I can't imagine why. <laughs> I need to know ahead of time to plan for the amount of food. Yeah. No, I guarantee I don't make more than you. A year. You can sometimes pack some food away. No, I. No, no, no. Hmm? I am. Oh yeah, 40 hours a week. I can. They uh, have been breeding Kurgan all week uh, with Ulu again. We're repeating the breeding that produced uh, both uh, K-Bar and Puko. And uh, we were so happy with that we wanted to repeat it. So it's going to be some fun puppies this summer. There'll be uh, a couple of pups I'm getting back from the breeding we're doing with Rob here. And then there'll be a whole nother litter of Lycan Shepherd puppies you'll get to see me raise up uh, like I did last year. You have no idea. She tells me not to. The Magi, if you decide to bring Magi. Oh, yeah, yep. And then once Magi comes in, too, we're going to be hitting her this year. I'm pretty excited. If you like seeing some of the training techniques I use to. Uh, get my dogs to where they are uh, this summer will be a perfect opportunity I mean I already have videos on the channel showing all that but uh, sometimes people like to see it with each successive litter
but it's fine. They have, they're they're well established. But no, so one from Brooklyn you, Park. Well, I expect to see my chubby by the work. We're gonna come and come down. Again, I haven't eaten for about uh, 18, 20 hours now. Again, I do intermittent fasting and eating a little bit later tonight because uh, we're cooking here. This is going to go down pretty good. <laughs> oh, man, it smells, it smells so good. <clears throat> so it's like brat buns or something? They're, they were labeled hoagie buns. I think they're a little bit smaller than what I would have normally have liked, but... Um, Just means two sandwiches. <laughs> right, right. That's why I bought three packages. <laughs> so, yeah, you know. <clears throat> he was walking? She called she called me. It was her that called. Eighty years old. Shot herself the Eighty years old. You never know. That's like so Colton. And uh, Steph uh, worked for 911 dispatch, so they're talking about calls. Right, shop talk. Yeah, shop talk. Shop talk. That's why there's no names. Yes. <laughs> Rob's a mechanic, and I'm a retired animal warden. Set a little aside and just throw the provolone on it for a second. Oh, I even started that point. Yeah. Oh, okay. Awesome. Oh. Getting ahead of myself. Yes. The provolone is done for order. Thank you very much. You're welcome. What's your website? Oh, I have a, a Teespring store through my YouTube channel that uh, just sells stuff with my logo on it. Oh, cool. I just purchased two premium sweatshirts and a tank top. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome. I wish I could have uh, given you a discount on it, but uh, I don't keep an inventory of it. They do all that stuff through online. Okay. Is that okay. It's all for you anyway. Huh? Oh, yeah. oh, dude, that looks so good. Give me a three or toss just a little extra. 
nice. You want peppers, right? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's creamy salad. Look good. Nice. Damn. Come here for a minute, you can get a shot of me trying to eat this thing. Oh my god. See this thing here? I do see it. Let's come closer here. Wait, wait. Okay. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Somebody chastised me in the comments the other day because you didn't have a monster. No, I was drinking a Nestle water and they do horrible things in South Africa or something. They said I was. Who knew? I was just drinking water. <laughs> you listen to your other fan that says don't drink monster. I can't win either. I'm killing myself with monster. I'm hurting people drinking uh, Nestle water. Like I'm in here. Get a close up of this thing. Uh, Tammy, here's your. Dude, way better than the burger yesterday, which is incredible. I think the ribs beat it out just a tiny bit, though. But man, this is a very close second. This is really it's a race, good. not a marathon. <laughs> oh, sorry, it's a marathon, not a race. Mm -hmm. Set it backwards. Is that? Mm. Mm. Do you want to do it here? Hold that plate. Look, there we have Tammy's. Tammy's here. There you go, Tim. Wow. I know how much you want me to get a shot of you taking a bite yeah, of that. I see that. I hear that. Awesome. Yeah. I have trouble with, uh, you set it down there for a second, let it cool down, and you can get your other stuff. You want to take a bite? Um, not when it's yes. that hot. <laughs> Watch me. I will. So good. Yeah. Thank you very much, Rob. Yes. You know, I don't usually... Hmm? I got something on my face. Delicious. Oh my god, that is so good. It is. I wasn't exaggerating, was I? <laughs> I know uh, when you watch a lot of these YouTube uh, mukbangs, uh, it's kind of like watching a porn. Everybody's faking how much they're enjoying it. That doesn't happen here. This is that good. <laughs> the aju so hot it's melting the cup. Oh no. You want you want to dunk yours? No, I'm good. You want to dunk a little bit? Try it. All right. I use your uh, French onion. I do. 
Rekker's going on a walk. Going on a walk? Uh, do you have a bag? Nice. Uh, no. Grab that. There's Rekker, uh, walking Come on, with Rosaya. Peace, sweet boots. Come on. Give you a chance to see the wreck, man. He's doing good. Oh, yeah. What's up, homie? doesn't want peppers. That is me. Max does not want peppers. Here you go, Max. Sweet. Oh, dude, you gotta let me get Golden. you out of eating it. Right. Peppers or no? You sit down there if you no want. Peppers, no peppers either? Okay. So good, huh? Mm-hmm. So good, so good. Uh, what's in the potato salad? Potatoes, some eggs, some mayo, some mustard. Um, you like oh. that one. You like that one? It's like uh, the steak one? I don't yeah. like mustard, so that would be the only no, reason I would like not. it. Yeah, that one's not yellow, so. I'm gonna take a bite out of this. This is looking awesome. My youngest son, Max, he's 19. How was that, huh? It's pretty awesome. Pretty good. Way better than the one at Carboni's. Yeah. Dip in that. Mm. That's some Aju if you want to try. Dip in that. Dip the end I haven't bit out of. E either one is yours. That's your Aju. <laughs> oh, it's my Aju? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. You can dip any end you want. Mm -hmm. I think I might have to chop it up like that, that next time. Usually when I make it, I just lay the the pieces of roast beef out and cook them, but I'm going to try chopping it up like that. I kind of like that. Gives it a little Especially different. Especially when you're doing like, gives it a little, a, different, a little different pull when you buy the meat. Yeah. You liking that, huh, Max? Mm-hmm. <laughs> This is uh, that's like Sarah accepted that's Sarah made last night. That Southwest chicken salad. Well, Southwest chicken yeah. salad, and then Southwest Cammy made. Uh, I don't know what you would call this, but kind of a, a fruit and veggie salad. This looks really good. You like the yeah, ajou, huh? Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. Yeah, uh, it's the same like French onion soup that I use when I make it. Thank you again, Mr. Grill Pimp. You're welcome. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you, Robert. Awesome. You're very welcome. Yeah. Thanks for coming. I hope you enjoyed our uh, latest edition of Cooking with Rob the Grill Pimp. <laughs> You're welcome. Merch to come. Huh? <laughs> said merch, merch to yep. come. It's pretty tasty, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs>
Have I? I don't remember. Yeah. Yeah, the, if it's yellow, it's got mustard. All right. Because I don't like mustard, right? This, yeah. This if doesn't have mustard, I should If it's like. yellow, it's got mustard. I'm not a big fan of like mustard on a burger, but I like using it as a seasoning and stuff sometimes. I like like the the stone ground and the like the grape coupon. The good mustard. Yeah. Not you know like the yellow mustard. Uh, it's good at actually if you take a chicken and rub it with the whole chicken, rub it with yellow mustard, yeah. and then season it, and then flip it and put it cook it on a beer can. That's good. Well. Let we, me know, just we, let me know we, next time you're doing it. We can do one of those. <laughs> no, there's plenty. Oh, there's so much. No, there's plenty. We're good. Thing is, we know I normally don't eat when I cook all this stuff. <laughs> That's a problem. Is it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't have a problem eating when I'm cooking. I have to I have to make some more buns. Half? I would say half. Rob, do you want to do a little? He's got his little machete there, and the thing will work. It's easier. It's always best to have not enough than more than enough. Always come back for more. You know, this stuff makes great leftovers too. Whenever uh, we have it left over, I'll uh, throw it in like ramen noodles or something like that. And then uh, once the water's boiling, you crack an egg in it, make a little egg drop soup with. I'm telling you, man, this roast beef with egg and ramen noodles, and then you add uh, little Frank's hot sauce or some cayenne. Yep. Oh. Sorry, Tammy. meal you can make in about five ten minutes it's yep tasty got you know protein is, got protein i'm gonna make them and hell one one egg is six grams of protein right. typically you know anything you know what else is really good in ramen noodles is uh pepperoni cut some like uh, cute pepperoni up oh yeah yeah it really goes well with it Okay. And then we'll maybe give them just a little scoop of that. You can always try it. There's no harm in trying it. Is that for the boys? It sure is. Nice. The babes. Where's Nico? Did the babies. You want to tell Nico to come out <coughs> when you go in there? No, they're half and one anyway. I have, um, oh, you're toasting them? Yes, they're all toasted. Nice, huh? It's grill pan. Grill pan. There's a wrecker and Rosaya. I know how much she likes being filmed beating, so not. I thought I'd sneak in and catch her. <laughs> Pretty tasty, huh? Mm, yeah. So good. It was. What'd you think, Max? It was very good. Worth the trip over? Definitely. <laughs> nice. Well, I think we're going to end it here. Like, subscribe, and share. Bye for Rob the Grill Pimp. And Nico. Sarah. Yeah. There it is. Oh. See ya. Thank you.